Hello guys, welcome, welcome to my channel. Today I'm starting a new series in my channel and I try to show you useful free websites where you can create something for your uh, designs, projects, uh, images or animations and uh, I will show how it works. But before we dive into the tutorial, I have a quick favor to ask. If you like my content and find it valuable, please take a moment to hit the small like button and subscribe to my channel. Is it really helps to keep creating content for you? But now let's get started. So the first website, what I would like to show, this is the mapchart.net where we can create your own custom map, make a map of the world, Europe, United States, and more, color code countries or states on the map as you need it or as you wish, Add the legend and download uh, as an image file. Use the map in your project or share it with your friends. And the most important thing, this is free and easy to use. So, for example, I'm going to the word. Simple. As you can see, we have the map here already. When I'm hovering, so this is also good for some online uh, presentation when you're hovering the mouse. You already have the city, uh, city name, sorry, the country name. But uh, why is it uh, so good? So, for example, I would like to show the countries of the European Union. Uh, we just go into done, Z region or, or organization select. I just select the European Union and just click on the uh, color region. So now you can see all the European Union countries are uh, colored over Europe. And of course, we do not need the other part of the world, the map. So just go into the zoom mode and using the, the wheel on the top of the mouse to zoom in, zoom out. Uh, that's easy. And when I'm holding the left mouse button, I can move the map. And uh, the thing is, if we'll, if we'll have a PDF, a PDF a image file in the end, and this one this will be done by the what is on a screen. And as you see, you can hear the, here, you can see there the, the functions. So we have also, we can control with, with buttons, but uh, way easier to do it with the mouse. Don't show again, so we don't need anymore. Actually, exit, exit zoom. So when we hovering the mouse, you can see uh, uh, the country names. Or if I right click on a, on a country, you can uh, easily remove paint or pick this color or paint with uh, existing color or remove pattern. So that's a uh, here we can create something different. So if I scrolling down, you can create a legend. So if, uh, for example, uh, just uh, the European Union and here where you can re select the color, for example, like this. And also we can add a label EU. And here on the left side, we also have some other functions like uh, you also can change the, uh, the color or have in selecting tools we have also have some additional functions so you can uh, show the country names we can change the back background or uh, border color or we can turn on turn off the the borders show the u.s states uh, show the canadian provinces or split the uk to the the part of the country and also show major cities as you can see we can turn on turn off these uh, cities also and here in the legends we also have options where you can uh, so visibility size uh, position background uh, columns uh, box shape lots of other things I just move back. So as you see, we already created the legend here, said European Union, EU. So when I hover in the country, which is selected, 
as you can see, also mentioned this is the uh, EU. When I hovering to other countries like Ukraine, not mention it because it's not part of the European Union yet. So I uh, just uh, and how we can really use it. For example, going again to the zooming mode, just a bit like Europe, exit zoom. For example, if you are a company in like you are a German company and would like to show where your company are also have a stores or chain or something, you can create also like a company You see blue, but if you scroll in down, we can change the color to whatever we want, like a brand color, like here, like let's just put some orange now. So, so you have a German company, but we have also the stores in Austria, Poland, Czech Republic, France. You can also add it like uh, like this. So that's in this case you have a Europe. A European map and uh, colorize the countries what you would like to show and how you can use it so just scrolling down download map and as you can see that's really useful so you can also have you have your own label but also customize the label so that's very very good tool, like uh, also like if you made a presentation, even you said, okay, in the time wise, that was like first was Germany, you can add, okay, it was in, on that year was only in Germany, and the next year was, you know, Poland and Czech Republic, or else you can create your separate map with adding these, these two countries also, then other countries later. So this is also very useful and uh, very good if you need a, uh, those kind of map this is the easiest way to do it for for free but now this tutorial is going to the end hope so you like it if you really like it please do not forget to hit the small uh, like button subscribe to my channel leave comment in the comment section if you would like to support me to support the algorithm and uh, just let me to share my tutorials with more and more people or if you are struggling anything in the canva just feel free to ask me in the comment section and i try to answer as soon as possible or if you're just also looking for a website for something else like you know i don't know for some animations or something or 3d models i try to find some useful what we can use in for free please check the description in the video because in the description you can find uh, links for my facebook page instagram page and tiktok page where you can find a bunch of uh, canva tutorials not only from me list in uh, facebook where you can find uh, lots of other tutorials uh, from another great canva experts so feel free to check my Facebook page, Instagram page, and TikTok page. As I already mentioned, you can find the links in the description. But now, this tutorial is really going to the end. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Ciao.